So I've been sick on Christmas Day and on New Year's Day, so I haven't really been enjoying the holidays. But today it's the first time I'm going out again with a friend. I'm going to have lunch out and then go to a super pretty Hanok cafe, so Korean traditional style cafe near Gwanghwamun Plaza. So yeah, I thought I would bring you with me in some winter days in Korea and yesterday Actually the whole night it has been snowing so it's the perfect winter day today So I'm wearing a super thick like jacket Which is going to be my layer number one jacket because over this I'm wearing a long padding It's not even that cold since it was snowing. It's like one degree but I'm very cold all the time. I'm ready to go, so let's go out. So today it's a super exciting day because I'm going ice skating with a friend in Seoul Plaza because each year they make an ice rink there. Um, they stopped for the past three years because of COVID but this year they opened it again and it's open from December until mid-February. So yes, I haven't been ice skating for years and years and years, like way before COVID, but I love it. It's such a fun activity to do in the winter. So yes, that's why I am super hyped today and I'm going with a very dear friend. So it's going to be a very nice day. So yeah. <laughs> And actually a few of you asked me over on Instagram how the winter is in Korea and if it is really that cold and yes it is very cold like today it's not uh, it's around six degrees now um, at peak time so it's 1 right now 1 p.m. so from 1 to 3 is kind of like the hottest time of the day and today yes it's going to be around 6 degrees but um, until a couple of weeks ago it dropped down to even minus 14 degrees and sometimes like the past few years it dropped even lower so yes if you come to Korea if you visit during the winter you need to be prepared <laughs> and wear like a lot of layers of clothes because also the thing is that indoors is very hot like if you go to cafes restaurants even inside the subway it can get very very hot so you could get sick like it happened to me because of the temperature change outside it's super cold and then inside is hot so you really have to layer i know a lot of people in korea they wear heat tech clothes those very thin like leggings and long sleeves top that keep you super warm so they wear that as the base layer and then over that they wear their regular clothes and also as i mentioned the long padded jacket that goes down your knees everyone wears those during the coldest days but yeah enough talking about korean winter let's go out ice skating <laughs> let's go let's go
We arrived at the cafe. Hopefully there are still cakes and also seats. I bought this gingerbread house cookie set something like one month maybe over a month ago to make on Christmas Day but as I mentioned before I was sick on Christmas Day and then all the way up to New Year's so I could not make it yet um, so I thought I want to do it today as a nice winter activity so I'm super excited and I'm going to go for a like white and pink frosting and pastel decorations and make it all cute. Here are the candies I'm gonna use to decorate it and then I already lit up my candles so I'm working in a very cozy and perfumed atmosphere and now I'm going to choose a Christmas movie to watch in the background. I know Christmas is over but I don't know there's nothing cozier than a Christmas movie. I think I'm gonna choose this one, the holiday calendar, because it looks nice. So here are all the pieces that we're gonna put together. They smell so, so, so good. I'm dying, I wanna eat all of them already. <laughs> and then I have also the instructions on the inside of the box there were the instructions. So let's try to make this and hopefully it's not going to be a fail because this is my very, very first time making a gingerbread house. So well, let's see how it goes. I kind of messed it up already, like here, <laughs> kind of went inwards a little bit, the base part, so yeah. It's fine, it's so cute and it's so much fun. Now I'm going to put the other half of the roof on and then the chimney and we start the actual decorating.
so this is my gingerbread house it's so cute I love how it turned out I kind of messed it sometimes like especially here was like the first time I tried to make these kind of decorations and look here Ugh. but overall it's super cute so you can see this side is a lot better because it was my second time doing it so I kind of got the hang of it but I absolutely love how it turned out and this front I made a cute little heart at the top as well super cute I love it so I'm done let me know down in the comments below how you like my gingerbread house and if you ever made one if you have never made one before make sure to do it next time because it's so much fun and it's such a cute decoration and I'm sure it's gonna taste amazing as well and I just made some hot chocolate look how cute these look together my little gingerbread man mug and my gingerbread house they are so pretty so now I'm going to drink my hot chocolate and finish watching the movie and I don't know what I'm gonna do with this because I don't want to destroy it to eat it up I mean of course I will have to but it's just too cute <laughs> Sarangetun Jokisone Mare Jope